it's Andrea and I'm coming to you here from my bathroom and I'm going to be very open, honest and vulnerable with you because my bathroom is dirty. I just want to show you how quickly you can clean your bathroom with the Enviro cloth and the window cloth and I'm just going to do my vanity, my mirrors and sinks in five minutes or less. So here we go. Okay, so this is my bathroom. As you can see, there's lots of, that's makeup, and there's toothpaste on the fixtures, there's lots of spots on the mirrors, and um, lots of other fun bathroom stuff. So I'm just gonna first start with my damp Enviro cloth, and I'm just gonna go over, we'll start here, over all the mirrors. Since I'm doing this one first, I'm just gonna take my polishing cloth, and buff it out so that, that that one doesn't dry. And then I'm going to take and do my whole mirror. I'll probably do half of the mirror so that I can polish it before it starts to dry. But you can just use a little extra elbow grease if you've got stubborn spots on the mirror. And I'll stop there, grab my window cloth, and I'm just going to go back over. That side's already done. Take my window cloth and go, or my and by Rockcroft and go to the second half of the window. I hope you guys aren't getting dizzy with my videotaping. Sometimes I forget I'm holding it. So I apologize. But down here, you know, at the base of the mirror where the sink is is where we get the most spots. And they just wipe right up with this. And then I'm going to go back over with the window cloth. Okay, that mirror is done. I'm just gonna get this side cabinet. Okay, now the mirror is totally done, all the mirrors. And I'm just gonna take my Enviro cloth and I'm gonna start just going over the fixtures. The counters. And when you start to pick up, start picking up some debris, I like to do like a once over and then I'll rinse my Enviro cloth out. It's also great for any chrome fixtures, like I have this little hand mirror. It'll buff anything right off of it. So now I've got this sink pretty well done, so I'm going to rinse my Enviro cloth out. Any hair that will got caught up in there will go down the drain. And then while I'm doing that, I'm just going to give the sink a good wipe. Rinse it out real good. And I'll go on to the rest of the counter. This is my husband's side. It's dirtier than mine. Just wanted to make note of that. Although my makeup's on this side, so I guess I'm guilty. I 
the fixtures, the chrome fixtures is where I love to use this because it just takes them off effortlessly and you know that it's picking up any traces of bacteria or germs and you can just wipe it clean knowing that you're getting the germs and you're cleaning it. And because the EnviroCloth has the micro silver embedded into it, once I'm done cleaning and I rinse it out and hang it to dry, this silver will go to work in breaking down all that bacteria. By the time it's dry, it's completely bacteria free to use again. Okay. And so then I'm just gonna get, turn on the faucet, get the sink. And you can feel that soap scum, toothpaste residue just melt away as you wipe it. Okay, now my counters are pretty shiny, so all I'm gonna do now is take my window cloth, go back over the chrome and any wet residue that might be left over. And same over here. The Enviro cloth does a pretty good job of buffing it out, but the window cloth is a good follow-up just for a really good shine. So I know that took a couple more minutes than five because I like to talk, but seven minutes or so and your bathroom looks perfectly clean, good as new, and you can move on to something else. So if you have any questions about these cloths, give me a ring. I'd love to talk to you. Have a great day. Bye.